Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for June 22nd of 2022 well, it is titled Supernova Remnant, the Veil Nebula. So what do we see here? Well, this is an example of a supernova remnant and actually a very large one that covers about three degrees in the sky. Now for comparison, our full moon is only about half of a degree in the sky. So this would be six times larger than the full moon. And is the image of a star that exploded long ago. And we're seeing those uh, the parts of the star expanding outward into space. Now it's such a large nebula that it's actually known by multiple names in different parts of it. So we can uh, label a couple of those and we see to the left hand side the Bat Nebula. To the upper center we see Fleming's Triangular Wisp and off towards the right we see the Witch's Broom Nebula. And we've seen each of these at various times in our images uh, as uh, separate images looking at just one portion of the uh, Veil Nebula. But it is a very large nebula and in fact is uh, rather relatively nearby at only about 1400 light years. So astronomically speaking in terms of uh, stars that's actually a relatively close star considering the size of our galaxy. Now its image the colors are because it was imaged with three specific filters looking at the light of three different elements. So in the red we have sulfur. In the green we have hydrogen and in the blue we have oxygen and you may notice that other things are missing here as well in fact that we don't see any stars at all in the image well in order to allow focus on the nebula another image was taken and digitally processed to actually remove the stars that would otherwise be visible in the image so that allows us to see more detail within the uh, within the nebula itself without seeing the background stars behind it uh, coming through as a distraction. So when we see a supernova, it is a star that exploded long ago and it became unstable in one way or another and essentially tore itself apart. When a supernova occurs, it would become, if it's close enough, would become the, one of the brightest objects in the sky. And in fact, many historical supernovae have been seen during the daytime. So actually able to see them glowing during the day while the sun is out. Now that's incredibly bright because most objects you can't see while the sun is, is still out uh, because the sun overwhelms them in terms of brightness of the of our atmosphere. But a supernova, not the remnant, but the original supernova itself long ago, could have been visible during the daytime. We have not had a supernova like this in hundreds of years. So one of these times we will be due for one. There are many stars that could go supernova and they would give us a great sight in the sky as a very bright star would suddenly appear and thousands of years later left behind would see a remnant much like the one we see today. So that was our picture of the day for June 22nd of 2022. It was titled Supernova Remnant, the Veil Nebula. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.